Hey everyone, be here. So people like to do art, but art isn't as easy for me. I can't paint, draw, colour in or anything, or even paper mache. But now I found an art piece that I can do with my Tourette's and I'm going to show you it today. Now I'm off to Spuddings and Spotlight to get the materials to make my art piece. It's been so hard for me to find something to do with art, but I'm so glad now I'm going to show you my beautiful art piece. First, we're getting the varnish. The next thing we need is the string. A sneaky extra drill piece just in case if it breaks. And now we have to get the beads and the pretty feathers to make the piece beautiful. I've got all the pretties and we're gonna go home and start making it. So the first thing I do to make my beautiful art piece, I recycle things from nature. So I go find a really good gum tree stick, I strip the bark and now we wanna sand it. The next step to my art piece is to drill holes all up it. Now the next thing you want to do is lack it with a shiny kind of gloss. I just ate some. I wouldn't suggest eating some if you've got you. Oh. My mouth tastes like varnish, everybody. You just want to simply coat it and make it look pretty. Now we have to wait for it to dry. But it's just, I live in the Sunshine Coast, but today it's not sunny. We want the sun back, Mother Nature. So what I do next, I cut some rope about just over a metre, and then I burn the ends so they don't fray anymore. And then all I want to do now is put it up through the hole, and then you want to kind of tie, you might tie two knots with the big hole so you don't want it to fall through. Now the next step is just to put them all along. And now the next step is to put all the prettiness on. So you just want to put a knot where you ever want the bead, like this. And then you put this in the bead. Simply what you want to do next is just tie another knot to keep it in place. Yeah! Three, to, one more to go and then I make three for my OCD. Three is my number for my OCD. Oh my God, everything in three makes me go. <gasps> so I've got them all on now. Um, and the reason why I have them longer is because once you put the prettiness and the beads on, it makes it shorter. So you can never have them too long. We're slowly getting there, but I need to tell you about something. So I could go to the gym, it helped me sleep at night, but the thing that helps me sleep at night is when I'm looking at things really closely and doing things with my hands. And I found if I do Tourette's art during the day, I sleep much better at night. So when when I get to do some art and sleep good. So the beads and pretty ropes done. The next thing is the feathers and then we're all done. I know, it's looking good, hey? So there you have it, my Tourette's art. Doesn't it look beautiful? I'm very proud of myself this time. I think it's one of my best funs I've ever done. So, woo! This is another one I made. Here's another one. Out of my art and I'm so glad it looks awesome. Plenty more to make and to come in the future. Hope you've liked my video today. I've had fun and I love being creative and when I can find things that I can do it makes me so happy. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and comment and I'll see you on my next vid.